Happy Sunday, everyone. Welcome back to C Block. We're going to try and tackle nickel today. We've been trying to do it for about a week and we've not quite gotten there. So first of all, I just need to work out the metal we need, or the, or I should say it's sapphire and rubite. So let's set that up. This is helpfully already sapphire. So it needs to be rubite. How is everyone's weekend going so far? I took the kids skiing yesterday. We went to a little mountain up in New Jersey. Um, got told off because apparently it is safer to supervise walking around in ski boots than it is walking around in hiking boots, which strikes me as a little bit strange. I was also told the rules prevent anyone other than qualified instructors teaching people how to ski. It seems somewhat difficult to enforce that rule and equally somewhat dangerous, but what do I know? Presumably they would much prefer um, young children going around completely unassisted, but who knows? Okay, let's copy and paste this. Now, I should have done all of the early preparation to get this working. Probably got a couple of little filler-ins to do. To perfect it. But let's start by hooking it up. that. Let's see why this one here hasn't worked. <clears throat> Everywhere's got these silly tokens stuck on the end. Whatever you call them. Alien artifacts. There we go. They're not tokens. Okay, you're just missing a little bit of sulfur. As are you. You got a little bit of sulfur in here. Oh, one extra thing I did do yesterday, and you'll hear the alarms as we zoom in. I set up some extra power, so I copy and pasted our about gigawatt section two more times. So when the battery buffers fill up, which is happening slowly, the alarm will stop. <coughs> <clears throat> well, sorry, I'm not sure what's up with my throat today. And we should come out with a few hundred, um, a few gigawatts extra. Let's fix this up. Not sure how to just pick up the charcoal off the belt. So we'll pick it all up. That's better. Don't know what this is about. So let's fix that. This is very, very strange. This is supposed to be the wastewater pipe, yep. That seems right. in the clarifier that's been fairly common in this build I'm not I must have copied and pasted a bad thing I feel like I'm always fixing that particular clarifier it 
let's see if this comes through. Should. Low power. Ah, okay. Power plant needs to kick in. I've got it set so it doesn't start until we get to 350 gigawatts. And I don't entirely understand what happens with the heat pipe around here. It's like it cools down too much at some point. Maybe I need to work out what the heat capacity of a heat pipe is, because I might have overdone it. But this is okay. This is now doing the right thing. Same problem as usual here. Definitely copied a bad build at some point. You need to be sapphire chunks. Rubite chunks. The good news is this is the last of the tier two metals until we decide or unless we decide to go with some uranium processing. won't be doing that immediately so we can at least get on to tier threes which will mean acid production amongst other things will have to be increased okay you have decided not to work what is up with you? Missing sulfuric acid. Don't know why liquefied didn't come down. <clears throat> and what's happening here? Seemingly you have too much waste water. Yep, and it just didn't put a pipe in. It's so strange. There we go, that's better. That's all of them now working. Now we need to get the Purified water in a little bit bigger. Blueprint that one instead, so we don't have to constantly delete. And we will avoid blowing ourselves up. It's a fairly common... Okay. <laughs> I said that and then blew myself up anyway. The blow myself up wouldn't be so bad if it wasn't so horrifically slow when I recovered. Okay, I did have to patch up the silver production earlier today. Another warehouse had filled up, so I just had to take, take the sniper rifle to it. We're just thinking about the other things that we don't have in the new base as well this morning. We don't have the bricks yet. We've got normal stone. But we don't have any stone bricks, concrete bricks, or reinforced concrete bricks, as far as I'm aware. We have red clay bricks, but they're not quite the right thing. 
How far down have we got to go? Quite a few. So we're going to have to build that at some point. And we're also going to have to build some concrete, or I guess cement. That will then let us build the concrete. Still a little bit short of the steam turbines. That was normally cobalt steel, but it might be red circuits as well. Come on. We'll collect the pipe. Save the bots a task. How many more to go? Two more. And then the next thing we're going to do today, once we've got the nickel going, is we're going to fix the balancers on the ingots. Because if anyone's looked at those, they are not exactly balancers, rather um, very inelegant splitters. And then we're going to put the plates in that we're missing. So we don't have any steel plates, aluminium plates or aluminium, aluminium plates or silver wire, silver plates or silicon. That will mean we're able to produce the red chips. Which I think we want too far. Yep. I can stop here. And then once we can produce red chips and then blue chips without too much effort, so that down there. And while we're here, let's get this up here. And the filters are all wrong, of course they are. Oh, I've got a bunch of wood in my inventory. Let's fix the filters quickly. So you want to be sapphire. You are rubite. Sapphire, rubite. There we go, that fixes the filters. Now let's go back and fix up the awful let's make sure we stay away. Awful explosions. And we've broken this one, so we'll fix that. And then we'll put the last one in. And then we'll check where the water comes. Yep, that's right. It should come out down there, good. You need to go here, like that, so the crushed stone comes out. The 
clean up a few of these leftover signals. I also did a little bit of signal cleanup last night because there were a few places where the signals just didn't work. Because as we had copy and pasted them, the trains had been set up slightly differently. There we go, that's better. That seems in line. You do not have purified water. Where is that? You have too much wastewater, good. That's what I expected to happen. So I want to sort of grab you. Like this, come over here. Let's work out where to put you. I need to grab you with like, the belt on so I can line it correctly. There we go. Just help the bots out. I don't know why it always resets its angle. Good. There we go. Crushed stone belt, a bit contaminated. It is, yes, I have to fix that up. Um, I had a mismatched belt, which meant when I rotated it, a few things escaped. And I have the same problem over on this side where I didn't put the filter in correctly for the chunks. We're going to go take care of that as well. Oops, and we missed a bit of water. How are you today? Oh, hiya, sorry. I hope I pronounced your name correctly. Down here is full of chunks. Three, one, two, three, three. Let's take that. This should clear. That's is right, I think. Have I got the colors right? I don't think so. Okay, you output cyan and blue. Let's fix this up. Our expectation is we'll get a lot more cyan and blue. So we need to make those the larger processing. So I need yellow and red. we go. There's still one of these that is malfunctioning. This one. There we go. Set the recipe here to now be Nickel ore. Let's fill in this gap. There we go. 
That's correct. Hit it right the first time around. Good. Okay, so you're now missing some sulfuric acid. See if we can fix that. Sulfuric acid requester. It's stuck up there. Yep, and there is a break at the rail stop there. Let's go fix that. And there's another break over there. Let's fix that as well. I don't know what the bots are doing. So why do you no longer work? You should be able to get there. This was yesterday's problem with the train network. Destination full. Okay, so it's no longer a path problem. You don't have anything in you. No path to producer. Strange. Maybe I just need a couple of signals here to indicate the route that you can take. That's right. That's right. You have fuel, you have fuel. Signals here and here, so that you know the direction. It now says destination full. Does that mean it's trying to go that way? Shouldn't be. Ah, so it doesn't have, that's the problem. So if you're acid, you're saying it doesn't have any space. Seems very strange because it's got a giant tank of sulfuric acid ready to distribute. I think I probably need a second sulfuric acid train as well. So we'll add that while we're over there. Let's kick that out of our inventory and that. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Let's put those back quickly. Want 
zero of them not not none okay this is sulfuric not the next one sulfuric acid wired up wrong no, it's not this is where it's wired up wrong So has train stop one, that's better. Okay, while we're here, let's just make sure we put one more down. Add station, sulfuric acid provider. Full cargo, sulfuric acid requester, empty cargo. So where are you planning on going? You're going over there, that's fine. I actually want you to go here. But say levy. Ah, you don't seem to have what you need in terms of charcoal let's take that automatic now that should work let's just go back and try and work out why that other train Seems stuck. Ah, oh, it seems to have gone now. That seems better. No. It's over at Nickel. It's the top right of the Nickel section. Or the, or the one before Nickel, I should say. Let's see if we can work out why that's gone wrong. obviously going to be to do with my crappy train signals. But I can't immediately ascertain why. I'm also pretty sure I've overused train signals. So you should be able to go down there. Why can you not? Should be able to go this way. Seems like you can get there. One dodgy signal over there. It's flashing strangely. That shouldn't make a difference though. It means the signal is not going to work rather than it's going to block. Yeah. You can get there. Why 
Why are you saying no? Your signal is correct. That's right, so the signals are on the right hand side. Do you go along to there? See if we can follow him and see how he gets on. And see if once he gets there, he goes to the right place. So it's right at the end you can't get through. That's mean I've done something really silly. We'll check quickly, otherwise we'll go back to finishing our nickel. Ah, power two kicked in, but it hasn't started producing power yet. Still heating up by the looks of it. Ah, no water. Okay. That's why. Why is the destination full? Sulfuric acid producer. Ah, someone else is already heading there, that's why. Go over there. Hmm. Why are you stuck here? Okay, at least you're all the train that I want and you're coming to the right place, so we'll just go back and check on you. I think this is almost certainly because I have too many chain signals. essentially made the entire rail one train at a time which was not the intention because I can have them wait in these station gaps and things like that which is what I need to do so we'll go back and fix that but first let's see if some sulfuric acid has appeared here it has and some more has turned up Looks like it's missing filter frames. Okay. 
Okay, I don't know what happened there. But as soon as I put filter frames in here, I think this should work. Assuming I also do this. Because my logistics was off, I do not have the thing that I need. Just gonna take a little while for the pump to turn up. So let's just fix this because it's wrong. That's right, that's right. That's right, that's right. That's right, that's right, that's right. Tiny bit of this. Okay, let's get the balancer. The ins and outs here that you can see are so that we can either feed in extra metals from non-catalyst sorting or take them out for petrochem processing. So let's have a quick look at what we think our nickel layout needs to be. This is nickel. So we can take this away. So each one needs to be six to four. I'm going to make this nice and easy for us. It has to be purple. It has to be purple. So that's blue to start with, and that has to be purple. Okay. And we'll just do it. Um, we'll do it eight wide. We're going to mimic the iron setup. One. Okay, I have no idea why the iron setup is so strange like that. Basically screwed up the spacing by the looks of it. Nope, I never upgraded iron to be the same as steel. Sh iron should look like this. Even steel is wrong here. Because there's some funny gaps, but never mind. We can fix this. Something like that. Processors. With most of these recipes, we've been trying to do as much direct insertion as we can. And I want one of these, these and one of these. Then like this is the basic layout. Now I should have those buildings, yep, yeah, they should be produced. So we need to have a small amount of sulfur flowing through here and some charcoal because we're going to need some power. Just to charcoal on the top like this and sulfur and I also need carbon monoxide. Okay, how are we going to make carbon monoxide? I think we make that from carbon itself. Yeah, so what else uses carbon monoxide? Nickel. So we're going to need a carbon setup. 
Then we have that over by copper, so let's grab that. Nope, there's like copper needs charcoal, not carbon. We have tin that needs carbon. So I think I can do something like this. Just grab this bit here so that it's sort of aligned with how we want to do it. Is that fair? No, it's too far down. Okay. So if we put it here, it seems okay. Then I can get carbon and sulfur in. this good now I don't actually need the carbon but I do need the charcoal coming out so how do I want to do that Let's split you like this. That means you can take the second line, you can take the first line. Yeah. Now, how do we produce carbon, di carbon monoxide from charcoal? Just carbon in a liquefier with purified water. Two liquefiers. Two. And it's one water plant. It's easy. that your charcoal requester good Good, train's heading over to me. That's what I need. Then I need to make carbon monoxide. Water processing plant. Let's put it here. some blasting charges don't have any offshore pumps in my inventory yet 
Are some on the way? On the way 20. Fine. Okay, the some have turned up. My bots seem particularly slow at the moment. Clarifier. I think it's because my mall is so, so far away. I hadn't sort of thought of that when I laid it out as I did. The bot travel term is going to become the bottleneck of my operations. This should now be carbon monoxide. So how do I want to feed you in? I reckon like this. No. Like that seems better. That seems right. Like that. I think that's good. While those pipes turn up, let's see if we can work out what has Go wrong with the geodes. There's just no offshore pumps. How long until the offshore pumps get here? There should be some bots coming over with them somewhere. It looks like the bots are too busy filling in other parts of logistics. This is the cobalt section, I don't care about that. I just care about getting my offshore pumps in. I wish there was a way you could track where the bots were. I think that would be really helpful. Using back to my signaling, I think what I really want to do is the gaps between these stations, because I'm fine for people to wait there, need to be more like this. That way I establish gaps in the chain signals. And stop causing problems. So for example, you should be sort of like this. Because there's nothing fancy along here at all. Right now. And I can't do anything until the silly pumps arrive. Your charcoal's are full, never mind. Let's get you in, you in. Then your charcoal is coming down here. Like this to go. Back here. That 
that. Now sulfur. You are a sulfur requester. Would you say zero because you should have everything comes out as minus one. You don't have a limit. Twelve K. D is nineteen K. D is greater than you output one. That's better. Hadn't wired it up. Sulfur provider. Full cargo. Sulfur requester. Empty cargo. Check we're not standing on it. Off you go. Did those offshore pumps arrive yet? Not yet. Let's see if this is them coming through with this batch of bots. So you're filling me up with sulfur, but reasons I don't understand. Okay, here we go. Pumps are here, good. Okay, you can come here, bots. Doesn't like it when I pop in and out of the logistics network by the looks of it. Or else it just filled me up. Whatever. This one here needs its purified water to start producing catalyst. Let's see if that goes through. Uh, and the filter frames. Fine. Okay, it's time to check on sulfur. You are Missing this. Go along here. It's okay. Still can't get to the provider. It 
Seems like it's something over there. It's screwing it up. So many rail signals where I've copy and pasted this. We will have to come back and I think I'll make this an offline exercise. Refix a lot of the rail signals around here. That's right. You can go there. Is it just you can't? Get in there. Yeah, that's the problem. Okay. It means I did it one too far across, too far away. I'm going to hop back into the train because it will take us back where I need to go. And we'll work out if we just want to move this station one across at some point. I think we probably could. And then it would probably fit. I got the filter frames, I do, perfect. You've got enough here to get started. So let's get you on your way. How are you getting there? Wow, okay, you go a long way around. I wonder if this is going to cause me a problem at some point that I have to travel so far on a train. We'll find out. The cargoes are pretty big. I think if I get the trains upgraded once more, there should be plenty of capacity. Let's hop out. Filter frames now. Down here for the catalyst. There we go. Catalyst in. Let's sort the power out over here now. How do we want to do that? That seems okay. This seems nice. Like that. Uh, ah, okay, so this is wrong. You, I need to split here. No, nope, it's still wrong. You just split here. Go like that. like that. That seems okay. Nice and compact. Then take put take put 
take put take put good power wise four good Okay, recipe, process nickel. Ah, you need you to be the level... No, you can do it with level fours by the looks of it. Level, yeah, level threes. Copper, iron, lead, manganese, nickel. There we go. the sulfur let's bring you up here like that Uh, no, take from the top, put in there. Take from the top and put in there. Oh, is this another one that inputs and outputs nickel ingots? Okay. So this is like the silicon. We'll do near like that. Where can I get some cheap nickel ingots from? I think we've probably got to run over to the old base to grab that. To bootstrap. I don't like these recipes where you need nickel ingots in and then nickel ingots out. Or silicon ingots in to get silicon ingots out. It's just extra pain for what doesn't seem to be a lot in the way of benefit. Because it seems such an easy way to fix. You just sort the inserters out so that they output before they take the next lot of input. Yeah, that order. Let's grab some nickel ingots. A few more. I think if I grab 200, that should get me started. Oh, here's the salt production. We set up a couple of weeks ago. It seems so long ago since we put some of these builds in, even though it's only been a few streams because we haven't been around much in January. What's that? Clean those chests out. Don't need this old artillery. This also I don't need. Bet 
Espera. Okay, Catalyst is coming out. That's good. It should mean the ore starts backing up. Good, good, good. Uh, okay, let's start on this side with the first bunch of nickel. Good, then you should start kicking in. You have, you have, you have, good. Okay, nickel ingots. So, if you hear, take you and just sort of duplicate you near as possible. Don't think there's any particular reason not to. Now, you want to be responsible for populating these two belts. That seems right. Then you can populate these two belts. That's going to keep building. Sulfur comes down here. Charcoal. You come this way. It's actually just change you and split you off there. That's just much better. Just less double belt. Less undergrounds. Put a let's just hope it merges in. There we go. Ingots. Let's make sure that you are now a nickel ingot provider. Nickel ingot provider. Okay, now let's work out how we flip this monstrosity. That's always the problem. until the new version of Factorio anyway, where we get built-in flipping. I think I largely can't do too much about that. Then I want you to come this way. I'm going to join up there. You 
go that way. You go like that. That's right. Let's check that this works, then we'll duplicate it. Uh, no nickel ingots to kickstart this one. Carbon monoxide missing. There we go. That seems right. Good. We are nickel ingot positive. Took us an hour and 10 minutes. Isn't terrible, I suppose. Next step is going to be fixing up that power. So I think given that this looks mostly right, what I'm going to do is grab the start of this. Make sure to put it one over so that it lines up. There, let's grab the rest of you, put you there. Let's grab you there, you there. And then while the bots are producing all of this, I want to go and check on the power. This works. This works. Basically, we can't just load it into the trains fast enough. That's fine. That's a good place to be. Yep. OK, we're going to go make sure that we've got water on the power plant now. Then it's on to the metal plates that I skipped. We didn't produce steel, aluminium, silver wire, and silicon. Not sure we'll get everything done today. And interestingly, Fuel 3 still has power problems. We can check. But even if I don't get all the plates set up, if I get everything but silicon done, because silicon's the harder one, I think that will be a good position to start the next week in. This is the fertilizer setup that I never finished, but we will have to. Uh, where's the power? Oh, it's just down here. Now, where did I put the water in? Can I just get the tiles? If I blueprint this with tiles, Maybe a bit further. Delete all these old blueprints. Every time you blueprint something, it saves it into your inventory for you, which is fine, except when you do lots of little blueprints like this. that mean you end up with an inventory full of stuff that you don't need. Should we include tiles? Let's take off rails. Take off the power poles and things. That's better. Mm. 
Where am I standing? I don't want to blow myself up. See if they've done their job. See if they've done their job here. Good, that's now churning, 1.8 gigawatts. Ah, so these haven't quite finished producing the bio processes, that's why it's just a bit slow. Getting started, okay. Second power plant's running. We're at 2.4 gigawatts now. Okay, so the majority of this plant is not working, but that's okay. Should eventually come online. But I like that we're up to 2.4 gigawatts. Okay, let's see if nickel finished itself. Did, but we don't have the charcoal wired up. It's okay, we can do that. There's plate production time. Running down here, I feel like this is where I need my Stargate network again. I was talking about that a couple of streams ago where I need a little set of like warp points from my mall to each metal in each production chain. I am going to go have a look and see if there's a mod that lets us set that up quite nicely. Oops, I think I've got some spare artillery shells here. We do. Let's grab that. Come over here. And we'll try to kickstart the nickel production. Good. Does that do the right thing? Let's find out. Not yet. Gas is missing, yep. Gas is missing. That seems better. Indeed, that's working. Okay, that's nickel. Something's wrong here. You don't have oxygen. Why do you not have oxygen? Plenty of oxygen gas inside of you. You never got hooked up. You have nitrogen not able to get out. That's where you don't work. Ah, too far, okay. That's okay, so What 
what's this for? Isn't that pipes doing anything? Yeah. this work now? That seems better. What are you short of? Zinc oxide. You have too much sulfur dioxide gas. Where is sulfur dioxide gas going? Over here? Which is conveniently missing link up. That's better. There we go. Okay, that's fixed. Steel time. So what's this? This is silver. This is aluminium. No, this is silicon. Aluminium. Now steel is over here. Now the thing with steel and why I didn't do it the first time is I'm going to need to produce both cobalt steel and normal steel. If I want to produce normal steel plate, well, it's steel plate coils. This. Molten steel. I think I want to do it from steel and silicon. It's 24, it's 240. No point in wasting cobalt. I don't think. Do it that way. Use the purple machines. Purple machines. So we're going to need 78. I want to use about 90 of them. So what if we do like two blue belts? It's probably okay. No, that's a bit too, too, bit too many. Because I'm going to produce 180 steel ingots a second. That's probably about right. So this is three, let's just lower it. It's about two and two, so nine and 12. This is probably okay. Now my problem is going to be, where do I get the coolant in and where do I get the silicon in? To do this correctly. I wonder if I actually need steel ingots on a train. Let's work out what's going wrong here. No limestone. Hmm. Something's not right. Because I have limestone. Six. Three, four, five, six, seven, ten. 
20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. It's 160. Okay, so train now comes. It's correct. I think I just moved this whole thing across one. That's what we've done wrong. should do it. Good. That's fixed. Okay, steel is back on. Now we do actually have quite a lot of space in most of these. So I think I probably can get a station here for silicon. If I look for cobalt steel. It's cobalt and steel. I could do everything with cobalt. But that seems less good because I'm probably going to want to use the manganese eventually that we're going to produce in steel. So let's not do that. So let's grab you. Let's kind of flip you. Of course it can't. Put you here. That seems okay. No, nope, it's not right. That looks good. We'll make you request silicon ingots now. Something like this. Instead of being a limestone requester, you are silicon ingot requester. That's good. Let's get a train here now. I'm 
new charcoal in my inventory? I do. Let's chuck some of that in there. Stick you over here. Something like that. Good, a thousand's on the way. Good. Well, good other than the fact I didn't wire everything up. You want to go to Silicon Ingot Provider. Okay. I'm going to have to rename these stations because I just can't tell. The colors are too much the same. Silicon Ingot. As silly as it sounds to use a symbol and the words. I know if I don't, I will screw it up. Full cargo. And you are silicon ingot. Empty cargo. Why is only one of them accessible? I think it's just too close to the junction again. Let's just quickly check. Is silicon. One further back. No, it should be fine. That's why. And that is why. Check again. For the cargo. Questa empty cargo automatic. Okay, while this is running, I'm just going to go refill my water. I will be right back.
Okay, water refilled. Let's get back to this. I think what I actually want to do, I just thinking about it, so I'm gonna make this exactly two blue belts. Or as close as I can get it. Do you want, okay, that's fine. Then that way I can take half of this merge it with the silicon Maybe with the steel even over here. So that's two, that's two, and now I want four of these. So I could probably just make this, let's make this produce me four belts out so that it at least lines up. See what that gives me in terms of space. So if each one of these, and you divide it by two, so that's 25. So it's five and then seven. So if I start with Something like this. So this is the coolant section. Yep, want the coolant section at the top, I think, in most cases. Yeah, definitely at the top. Seven, is that right? It's five and seven, yeah. Then probably just over split this. And do the same again over here. Take you two up. Let's not make this into eight lines of steel ingots. I'm never gonna use that much. Let's put this back to something a bit more sensible. Just don't need that much. Let's put you back to four. this so just to make the whole thing a little bit easier to manage so I'll then have four four bouts of steel ingots
Then I need two belts of silicon out. That's much more reasonable. Then you could actually, if I got this right, I could actually bring the silicon here and the steel here. You could just come that way, then you could go that way, that that's better first one down here Then you over here. Then take long. Take short, that's right. How have I got the stack inserters? So output long, near, take long, output far. So then output there, far. No, hold on. Take far, output near there. There we go. Okay, I need to go check on the strand casting machines. Do you get, I left myself plenty of space as well. <coughs> can I make this in the smaller ones for iron? I can. Fine, let's just do that quickly. Iron for steel even. Go back to making sure the logistics bots have given us a few of these so that when we do the next lot shortly, we can speed things up slightly. I don't need any sulfur on me. Tons of steel ingots. Good. 
Now, this need the water. The recipe needs to be the water recipe, actually. But I am going to make sure that I've done both of them. you to do that so there's then two and you come down there you come down here that then like this that simple no not iron simple steel then some water there is this now going to work I think it should there we go that's steel and there's plenty of space here for the coolant processing that I want to put in next We will switch this for manganese eventually, but I don't need to right now. Set the name of the station to provider steel sheet coil. Good. How's electricity? Good. Okay, everything's green apart from this one. It's got the wrong recipe. Good. Steel sheets. Okay, then cobalt goes over here and it will be fairly straightforward because it'll basically be a, mi be a mirror. Next up, aluminium. Now I'm going to do undo the same shenanigans here. Like I just don't need that much aluminium. I'm not going to be able to produce Oh, why not? We can keep it. It's fine. It's not hurting. Okay, need some landfill. so that we can start sketching out how big aluminium needs to be. Okay, not got enough landfill. So if I swap this for aluminium, And we'll do it with purple machines. Ah, I can only make aluminium with purple machines. So should I make it with aluminium, copper, silicon, aluminium, manganese? It's 240. I 
don't have any manganese at the moment. I'm going to use up lots of silicon if I'm not careful. I wonder if we just do the simple one to start with. Is there an even more advanced aluminium recipe that I haven't got yet? Let's have a quick look. No is the answer. So silicon is as complicated as aluminium in practice. It's not a simple one. So manganese is probably the one that I want, but I don't have any manganese. So let's set it up with manganese in mind. Yes, we'll do that. Now, if we did one blue belt, four blue belts, 315, that's too many. Let's do two blue belts, 157. I'm making 180, so I make it slightly more than that. 110, whoops, didn't want that. 108. 105, that's fine. So 21 and 27. So let's do this divided by 4. So it's 6 and 7. So I think I can basically copy and paste this bit. Put that sort of here. Is that right? It is. Okay, let's go get some landfill. Almost got run over by my own train. Now, where did I put the extra landfill that I had? It was over put it over here, didn't I, in the mall. Yeah, let's go grab that. We're going to do the same for silver, and then we'll look at how silicon's going to work. And while we're at it, we're going to set up the strand caster purples. Because that's going to be required. Take the personal logistics off. That's why it was going nuts. So, okay, so these are the purple strand casters. So we do not have many blue circuits. How many blue circuits have I accumulated over here now? 3,200, perfect. Let's go grab those. Make sure they're doing strand casting. Or at least some of them are doing strand casting. Uh, gone too far. Here we go. Two point four gigawatts. Make sure that you're producing a few of these as well. Go 
going to grab the first lot of these for our aluminium setup. So we can check that it works. It's getting exciting because now we have the advanced metals coming through. running over where's this is steel right run out of steel ingots why is that why have you run out of iron ore too much crushed stone Fine. Need to check crushed stone out. Let's get over here. Let's go fill in this bit. Slow it down before I try and shoot the worms. I haven't got the particularly good ammo in. But it shouldn't matter. You also know I've done this too much, but that's okay. things on the ground we just run it over with the blueprint we have a sort of pick up gunk blueprint somewhere okay something like that doesn't quite fit everywhere I don't entirely know what I've picked up everywhere because I've got some leftover bits in there as well. That's fine. Okay, let's go here. Let's take this away. Let's take this away. Let's get rid of this over here. Don't know what it's for. We don't need it for this build. Fix up all the signals shortly. That should at least join up. Yep, it does. Good. You are not silicon or you are going to be manganese ingot requester. Nope, don't. Grab that. Good. Okay, 
Okay, where's my inventory? Over here. Then let's... Go under here. Let's just clean this up. I'm just never going to use that much aluminium. It's just not, not even possible. Until I get more modules and things. Nope, you need to go here. You go like that. Like this. Can you... Go like that. Can you go like that? this you are going to be aluminium what ratio do I need I need six uh, six to seven so I have five to seven here if I switch it to the manganese one yes six to seven Okay, can I get one more of you in? Let's just take away the spacing. Good. We'll put the power poles somewhere else. Six, right? Six to seven, good. Aluminium sheet coils. So I do now need the advanced one of this. There's aluminium sheet coil. Take you away. Four, like that. That's better. A little bit of water. Aluminium sheet coils, good.
like a messy junction. That's better. That'll do. This is aluminium. Water hasn't come all the way down because the game is being silly. There we go. Sheet of coils. Can I sort of take this strand casting machine cannot be flipped? Fine, can I? Can't flip that one. <sighs> okay. Middle one goes to the top. The wrong button. I'm only going to want aluminium plates this way. So we'll just make extra aluminium plates. Let's try and... At least put some power here so that this loads up. Good. Exactly level. Seven. Which means it slightly overlaps. Then the next one. Hmm. This looks wrong. It was. Then same again. Good. Do I have any of those in my inventory? I don't. Let's get some strand casters level threes in here. Enable the logistics. We do have some in logistics storage.
while that's coming on we'll just fix the little rail set up over here same on the other side oh, the other side is actually fixed mostly too many signals in the middle Pretty sure this is entirely missignaled. I'm not necessarily sure it matters too much. Oops, hit by my own train. Okay. Let's head back over that way. It's gonna take a while to get there. And then we'll see if we can do silver and silver wire. I think we will save silicon for the next stream because it's gonna be a little bit more work there. And maybe we'll do silicon and concrete next week. Check on the time. It is one o'clock. Okay. So actually, I think we'll have to stop after this and we'll do silver next week as well. So we'll recover the body. We'll get aluminium flowing through and then we'll call this stream done. Oh, they've been successful. We got steel. Nickel, steel and aluminium plate all wired up. I'm running. And my attempts at building a rail network that I didn't have to mess with the entire time have completely failed because I've done nothing but tweak all the signals as I've added in all the stations. As it, as you can see the problem there, like all these signals suddenly go red as one train passes through. I mean, they've clearly done it wrong. Hmm. This one here is not working. Why not? Is it supposed to be connected? I think so. There we go. The reason for all the space here, if anyone's curious, is we're going to add the coolant there. I got confused for a minute there why I had copper one side and not the other. Okay. 1.95.7. This seems strange. Why are you not requesting a train? Got 7.9. U is 12. Fine. Okay. It's correct, just because we haven't upgraded these for the new size of chests and things. So slow. This is steel. It is cool to see it now humming along. I know we have quite a few train problems. But I do think they are not especially difficult to fix. Now where did I get smashed? I think over here. B. 
Good. That's better. The problem with some of these designs now is I haven't left any space here for modules or beacons, but we may just have to figure that one out. Let's upgrade you to the level two quickly so I can do the coolant setup. Can I just take you and flip you? Does that work? Let's find out. Seems like it. Put you back to level one. So water is this one. Let's do that. bots along a bit. So otherwise we'll never finish. Okay, research is flashing at us as well. I set up some bigger power poles. Not that I necessarily think we need them, but just to clear it off the list. Grab this, Let's flip you again, see if I can put you in the right spot. Whee, coils. That goes here. I don't know what the bots are doing. Good. Bots are finally coming in and doing their thing. And I'll easily be able to put manganese in here to increase aluminium production. I'm just going to check on how much longer I can go for. Let's see what else we can take. We'll take tungsten processing. No reason not to. We may as well do personal batteries. And Power Armor Mark Three. I can do. Okay, may as well research that as well. What do I have at the moment? Power Armor Mark II, which is 10 by 10. Power Armor Mark III is 12 by 12. But it needs level one module, so I can't produce any at the moment, but that's fine. There we go. I should get that moving, yeah. Let's just grab the extra landfill and we're gonna fill in the space where we're eventually going to put uh, copper, nope, silver wire silicon. Gonna go here. Oopsies.
It wasn't that wasn't good. Thought I cleared out all the worms. Do this. Silicon plates are definitely going to be the hardest one of all. because you have to do that silly silicon seed by a monosilicon and that kind of stuff to get going. See if we can avoid getting hit as we fill it in, even though the bite, uh, worms even are here. Let's find out. We mostly, mostly avoided them. Got one little bit to fill back in and we'll come back and do that. Then we'll make sure we blow them up with the artillery when we get back to our main store. Cool, a little bit of dodging that they don't get us. Cool. Okay, that's good. Okay, it seems a little bit slower now. Is it short of something? You are missing some inserters. On this side. Yep, and same on this side. So only half of you were actually working. There we go. That's why that seems slower. Most of this also needs to be scaled up to blue belts worth. And we're currently running it on red belts because we didn't have enough. Put you there, let's take everything here. I'm not so worried about the rails, I can fix those. Let's have a quick look what silver looks like. So I need two things for silver. I need silver wire and silver plates. What about product? I want a silver wire coil. Purple strain casters. Purple this, and I want to use 90 ingots. Okay, 40. Nope. 25. Okay, that's about right. Let's add one more silver. Let's do silver wire coils. Nope, I want. Oh, didn't mean to do that. that. Yep, that's right. And they said 90 of the, uh, no, 50. Nope, 25. That's better. Do one more. That's not the right one. This one. Seven ten. You want twenty five as well? Maybe. 
Molten well, silver. No, so I can do more than this. I can do 50. More again. 100. Okay. So I can do quite a bit more silver wire than I can silver. And I'm going to model it on the tin setup. But we'll do that next time. Is there anything else I want to do? Let's just quickly check. Aluminium. This is cobalt. I want to keep the cobalt set up. You're done. You're done. You're done. Can I reorder you? I can't. It's okay. I think I just need silicon wafers. Yes, I think that's all I need. So monosilicon. It's from here. I'll make you in a purple assembling machine. Then let's aim for two blue belts, maybe. Molten silicon comes from ingots. Wow, I can get. Okay, it doesn't need much silicon at all to get four blue belts of silicon wafers. Is that the right thing? Let's do silicon plate. Okay, no. Nope. So this expands a lot. So I don't want to produce that. I want to produce the silicon wafers. Do four blue belts of silicon wafers. That takes in quite a lot. That will give me a lot of silicon. I think it's okay to have some of my silicon extra. This comes from molten silicon. Yep. It's a tiny bit of molten silicon, a tiny bit of nitrogen, and then the quartz crucible. How do I produce that? So it needs a very small amount of silicon ore to produce the crucibles. Okay. So if we quickly wander down to silicon, how are we going to do this? Do I have some silicon ore left over? I should do. Yeah. I could bring some out and bring it up to the top to make silicon crucibles. I presume that that's better by quite a lot than the other one. So this is 40 for 4. This is 40 for 6. And I stand a chance of getting the crucible back. Yes, so it's definitely an improvement. Is there only two tiers of silicon? Silicon smelting, advanced silicon casting. Yes, there's no more. Okay, well, that will be the first stream for next week. So thanks for watching, everyone. Have a good rest of your Sunday. Bye-bye.